What's up guys? Today we're going to go over the top three exercises for core stability. Okay, so when I have patients with core stability issues, like Esty here, what we want to work on is stabilizing the entire torso into the pelvis. So the number one thing I give people usually is just a transverse abdominus contraction, which is very helpful for people. You put your fingers right above this little bump on your pelvis, and you're going to feel it and she's gonna try to contract that muscle. Sometimes what helps is doing a little cough. <laughs> and then just gonna feel that contraction. Sometimes when you laugh, you feel it too. Exactly. And she's gonna hold that contraction, flatten her back out, and she's just gonna breathe normally using her stomach, coming up and down. That's her diaphragm moving right there. She's gonna feel her abs contract. That's the first one. The second one, she can straighten out one of her legs. She can put her arms to her side. Gonna keep her neck stable and she's gonna tuck forward and just contract her abs, thinking about what we just did. We're piling on to what we just taught and come back down. She's gonna hold that contraction at the top, keep her back flat again, right? So we're maintaining that anterior core work instead of just arching her back every time. And the third one, she's gonna do a side plank. She's gonna go on her side. She's, she can just do it with a bent knee, actually, as a starting point. And she's gonna lift up like that. She's gonna keep all this nice and tight. And she's still thinking about her pelvic positioning being very neutral. This is tight right here. Breathing in and out, using that diaphragm so her belly's getting tension and it's not, then it is and it's not. We're gonna hold this one 30 seconds, okay? These are my top three exercises for people that need help with core stability. All right, good.